What's up, guys? It's Jay. We're gonna have to kill, and I'm back here on Destiny live in the Queef, and I'm here with good old Captain Stabbing, everybody's favorite dick in the eye victim. But hopefully, she will be getting that eye patch off soon because I do hear that Obamacare does cover dick in the eye accidents. So, Petra, we're gonna leave you here. I'm sorry that you have lost your depth perception, but. It's Friday, we're here in the Queef, and we must go and check out our brother from another mother. Where the fuck are you, brother Lance? It is time for another Trials of Osiris. <laughs> it is week three. Let's go ahead, pay our respects to brother Lance, and check out what he's brought for us to compete for this week. All right, so he has brought the grips of the exile. Now, these are actually really cool looking on the hunter because they have that blade right there. They're nice and smooth, and it really goes well with the uh, chest piece. Although, you know, Bajie doesn't want to allow me to just fucking... Can I rotate and, uh, and take a look at the other arm? Is the left arm the only arm that matters, Bungie? So, the perks on this... Uh, our pulse rifle loaders, you get an extra reload speed on the pulse rifles, causing damage which melee attack reduces your grenade cooldown, and also speed on your heavy weapon reload. And those of you guys out there, 42 light, this will get you to level 34 if you do need 42 light level gear. And we're rocking all discipline, that's right! These gauntlets do not rack the discipline, but if you rack the discipline, I recommend to go ahead and pick these up because discipline does not always come from within. Discipline comes from Grips of Exile. <laughs> so let's go ahead and see what else he's got. All right, silver and gold packages will give you guaranteed etheric light, guys. So it is definitely worth at least making a passage through once to try to get some of these packages. And, uh, you only gotta win eight times without losing three. I do, I, I do know a lot of people out there to say that it sounds a lot harder than it actually is. But if you get yourself a pretty decent team, go ahead and in the comment section down below, if you don't have anybody to play with, ask somebody in the morning after community to come and play with you. Ooh, they're gonna come and play with you. <laughs> as long as you can deal with sexual jokes, the morning after community should, uh, should oblige you and help you get your way through to at least get one of these silver I'm, I'm I'm confident that my community can at least handle getting you at least one etheric light, right? Go ahead. Comment section down below. Tell me what your console is, what your gamer tag is, tell people what gear you're rocking, whatever fucking, you know, what, what kind of class you're using. Are you a blade dancer, gunslinger? What do you got? Tell people. I do know that the Destiny looking for a group can be a little bit intimidated if you don't have the right gear to just boot you right out and move on to the next person. So uh, hopefully we don't have none of those douchebags in the good old morning after community. And the weapon for this week is going to be the Jewel of Osiris, which I don't have it on me right now. But uh I can actually... Actually, you know what? Let's do this. This is an app moment. We're going to go... Into my application on the bungee.net. If it wants to load, it actually isn't. But we're going to go ahead and grab my fate bringer from my level 33 hunter. I'm going to put this into my vault. And I'm going to move over here to my awoken hunter. And I'm going to pull my fate bringer out for you guys. Because I, I don't actually use this very often. A lot of people are like, oh my god, I didn't even know Matt kind of fucking fate bringer. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, that's it's actually not showing up. Oh, there it is. Woo, I thought I lost it in my, inside my vault. <laughs> so, here's the Fate Bringer. We're going to go ahead and equip this. This is why I say that the Jewel of Osiris really isn't worth it. Ready? Like, honestly, yeah. If you're, if you're going to be using any hand cannon in this game that has these specs, sorry, Jewel of Osiris, <laughs> Fat Bringer. Fat bringer all day long, especially because of that firefly perk, the arc firefly. It's like one of the only fucking primary in the game that has an arc firefly. It's absolutely amazing. Even though I don't use the uh, fate bringer, I'm just saying I have a fate bringer and I have a jewel of Osiris. Both of them in the you know the arc primary damage, and uh, I I would rather use the fate bringer than the jewel of Osiris. I'm just saying, but we'll cover that. 
in the future, we'll be doing a weapon guide on all these Trials of Osiris weapons. We'll be getting to that because, uh, you know, some of them are actually pretty good. Like, uh, this, this rocket launcher. <laughs> yeah. Woo. So thank you, Brother Lance, for bringing us another Trials of Osiris. Those of you guys out there that were wondering what is going to be the map in its Widow's Court. A brand new House of Wolves DLC map, which I've never played on, so I'm very seriously doubting uh, how well this is going to go this week. But at, at the very least, there's going to be a lot of people out there that haven't seen the map just like I have, but, uh, you know, it, it, it's going to be a learning experience. However, that's why I have my longbow synthesis on me this week, because I'm going to ascend this bitch. This is definitely getting ascended anyway, I don't give a fuck, so... Uh, I'm, I'm gonna send it, and I'm gonna try my hand at a little bit of the, uh, the old sniper snappy. And I still got a little bit ways to go on my thorn, but I feel like, since it's a long range map, I'm probably gonna wanna bust out my messenger anyway, just because, peace punch, Captain Crunch! My fucking thorn just ain't happening, Captain. <laughs> so, my name is Jay! More than after kill, I wanna thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys rate, comment, subscribe. If you could leave a thumbs up on the video, I'd highly appreciate it because it gives me motivation to make more videos for you motherfuckers that watch my motherfucking videos. Dick Eye, I want you to go ahead and take care of that eye. Make sure you flush that out two to three times a day with some uh, antiseptic. But make sure that the antiseptic doesn't have alcohol in it or else uh, you be in for a uh, extreme Dick Eye burden situation. But you're kind of sexy. Hey! No! Oh! oh, he just walked into her body. Uh, uh, woo! Oh my God! Thank God you, you you had the ability to get out of that situation. Oh no! No! Oh, she did it again. Oh, I was gonna I was gonna make out with her. We were having a moment, and that guy just came inside her. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to. So, like I said, my name's Jay. What did I have to kill? Thanks for watching. I'm gonna see you guys later. Ninja float, bitch!